Hi everyone, welcome back to Aphrodite Min and El Tero. Thanks very much for joining our channel today. It's very much appreciated. Just going to be doing a general reading for Scorpio. Please only take what resonates and leave the rest. Don't make the story fit if it's not your story. Okay. Sometimes I do say he or she. Sometimes the, the story might be vice versa. All right, I'm using a deck of cards that I haven't used for a long time. And they were given to me by a very special person. And it's called Ask Your Angels. Okay. Now, I felt like I had to use these cards because of your download, Scorpio. But let's have a look what's going on here. All right. So what your cards are telling you, Scorpio, is that you had a divine love. A divine love, which was a very strong connection. Um, it may have been sexual. But there was a connection between you and a person that was divinely brought together. And the reason why it was divinely brought together um, was because that you and this person had a quite a bit to teach each other. Okay. Um, and I kind of feel like, you know, that there was a lot of love, a lot of laughter, a lot of memories that was cre created. It was, you know, sort of like an equal mindset for a period of time. Okay. Because... You were supposed to take this person on a journey and they were supposed to take you on a journey. And I feel like this journey got cut short. And the reason why it cut, got cut short, Scorpio, was because that um, somebody was living in hidden worlds, okay? Somebody was living a life somewhere else besides the connection that they had with you, all right? Now... When we get this card, Scorpio, it, it's telling me that you may not have known about the secrets that this person was keeping, all right? And the secrets that you don't know what this person is keeping, you actually still don't know because you haven't really got clarity on what was hidden. It could have been a number of things that was hidden. They could have been in, in another um, relationship they could have stepped outside um, your third party or you could have been the third party. They could have brought other parties into the situation. You not really have the clarity that you really want, but intuitively you, you kind of know, okay? Um, and because of this, because of what this person did living in these hidden worlds, divine justice had to be brought in, Okay. Um, mainly because that, you know, you're an angel on this earth, Scorpio. You're here to teach and guide and make changes um, in people's lives, including yours. But um, that is the the sign that you're brought, born under, which is um, transformation, new beginnings. So you will find, Scorpio, that when you do enter people's lives, it's because you need to bring in changes and new beginnings, not only to to your life, but to the other person's life and especially when you're in uh, a connection as strong as this divine love okay yeah what i feel was that um there was a bit of a battle that went on between you and this person and it was a battle of the mind like the, the battle i feel was in your mind okay because your intuition was really really sparking to what was really going on you know i kind of feel like your third eye was opening you were seeing things that you were not sure of and you were experiencing dreams and uh, prophecies that you thought could this be true you know you weren't really sure but you were being heightened you know to to a different level okay now this person was supposed to come on that journey with you but they were taken out of that journey because of the hidden worlds that they live in Okay, now what I feel was there was a lot of conflict, conflict that you tried to bring resolution to, but there was no no resolution to this conflict, okay? It just went from bad to worse, possibly because of lies, deceit, um, possibly because this person was hiding things, possibly because, possibly because they may have felt or fallen in love with you, but otherwise, they went towards a different connection, Scorpio, 
okay and that took them off the track that took them off that track so once they went off that track you were not allowed to teach this person anymore you weren't allowed to show this person anymore okay so the divine stepped in and said no you cannot teach this person because they will use it against you okay so that was it something came to a completion I feel that you were very saddened about all this, that it came to the compl completion. You may have tried to communicate with this person, but the communication was stagnant. It just didn't happen. And I think you now understand, you now understand the reason why you cannot teach this person the the um, what the divine is, is, is teaching you, okay? Because... Uh, they will use it against you at the end of the day, all right? So in time, Scorpio, this person may come around again in time for you to give them the rest of the lesson because they'll be ready in time. But for now, Scorpio, I feel that you have to forgive this person. Forgiveness is going to be your key, all right? You're dealing with your emotions, and you are thinking that it's time for me to go home. Okay. You may be wanting to go home to family, some somewhere where roots, you know, you may be wanting to make roots, um, you know, in a home. There, You know, what this card is also telling me that there is a connection that is coming in for you, Scorpio, that you will consider this person to be home. You'll plant roots with this person. You will have a very strong connection between the heaven and the earth as above, so below. And you're healing. And your aura is being fixed right now. Okay? But you are healing and you have a lot of passion to offer. A lot of passion that is coming in. All right? A lot of peace that is coming in. You are choosing your peace. You are choosing to remain balanced in this situation. All right. Everything is a mystery when it comes to this person. They hide too much. And you're over the mystery. You're over being curious. You're over it. Okay. Um, had you and this person, you know, gone forward together, there would have been a lot of peace. There would have been a lot of balance. Okay. You need to see the beauty within you, Scorpio. You really need to see the beauty that is within you. God created you for a reason. And the reason as you get older in your life, you start to see the reasons why that you are here. I feel like somehow there's somebody that is connected to music that is coming into your life, Scorpio. Or you need music to heal, whichever one, okay? Somebody who is very spiritual. <clears throat> somebody who is going to bring you joy and somebody who is going to bring you healing, okay? I feel like you're not getting out, Scorpio. You're not getting out. You're not getting about. You're, you're just, you know, I don't know, almost like you're trying to, to heal and rebirth yourself one more time, okay? But you have a lot of creativity, Scorpio. Uh, you know, things are going to start being illuminated to you very, very soon, Scorpio. Okay? A lot of things are going to start to make sense. A lot of things are going to be more clearer. And I do feel that, you know, that some of you may be an artist. Somebody's going through the dark night of the soul. Somebody who knows that they hurt you. Somebody that, um, you know, has a lot of regrets, regrets and remorse for how they treated you. Somebody who doesn't know how to fix a situation. And somebody who is keeping their distance and keeping their silence because they don't want you to find out. But either way, Scorpio, you're going to find out. Right? The sun is going to shine on you again, Scorpio. You have a lot of hope in this situation. All right, you are going through some sort of an awakening, okay? Um, I do feel that very soon you're going to express your sexuality with somebody. Um, you know, you've been putting yourself away, not dealing with, 
your wants and your needs and you're going to be doing that Scorpio your intuition is just going to be sparking especially in the month of May and there is a message that is going to come in from somebody special it's a special message that is coming towards you Scorpio could be the month of May it could not be but it is coming okay and it's coming through your Afrua guardian angel it might be through a dream it might be in person but, you know, what the spirit wants you to know, Scorpio, is that you are very, very protected, okay? Nothing will will hurt you. They are protecting you from people that are, <coughs> don't, they, they mean you harm. They don't want what's best for you. And uh, you are being very well protected right now. So being removed from this person, even though that you love them, is, is actually a protection right now, okay, because of the people that they are dealing with, all right? You should pray for this person, Scorpio. Say some prayers for them, you know. You've surrendered to this. You have surrendered to it. You, you're just done, you know. You can't, you can't stay in your emotions. You can't keep trying to work out this mystery. You can't keep trying to fix this connection, okay? So you're surrendering, you're throwing your arms out in the air, in the air okay? Um, you know, you need to work on your health, Scorpio, or somebody's health is not too good right now, all right? I'm feeling that uh, somebody can't see clearly, especially when I look into these eyes. It's almost like they're, they're at a standstill, like just staring in one area, trying to focus, all right? So I kind of feel like somebody is um, has got issues with their eyes, okay? Um, you're going to be very, very grounded in the future, okay? And you you end up with prosperity at the end of the day, Scorpio. So I kind of feel like you know this now. You know that there's something coming towards you that, um, you know, your blessings are now being ready to received you were supposed to receive some sort of blessing but because of a block that came in um, you didn't receive it but you will receive it now Scorpio okay so prosperity is on its way and it's coming in in many many forms so you know your your heart will beat again you will love again you will see things a little bit more clearly and you need to see how beautiful or handsome you are Scorpio okay you're going to be attracting a lot, a lot of suitors, um, you know, and your whole persona, your energy is just going to change. But be careful of your health or somebody around you is going through some health issues at the moment, Scorpio, okay? Um, but you will find your home. You will find your stability. You will be grounded and you, you will be protected for a period of time until these people stop throwing these spells your way. But there is a block now between you and these people, and you can be free, Scorpio. Let it go. Surrender to the universe and just trust in your spirit guides because they will guide you in the right direction. All right, Scorpio, I wish you all the best and uh, good luck with um, that sexuality. <laughs> um. Yeah, good luck. Good luck with that, Scorpio. You know, I feel like it's it is something that will help you to set something free, and don't don't ever disregard your your needs and and wants. Okay, Scorpio. All right, everyone. All the best, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.